you know, the, the advances in sequencing have led to us having the ability to turn around a whole genome in these days, actually, less than a day, you know, 17 hours for the sequencing part. But what you're left with is a huge amount of data, so much data that the old way of doing it um, manually doesn't work anymore. The software doesn't give you the answer. Um, the software outputs data in such a format that a trained clinician or a geneticist can make the determination as to which variants are the ones that are causing disease. You use reference data uh, in the form of other genomes where you can try and work out whether the variant that you've seen is rare or whether it's been seen in someone else. And if it's been seen in someone else, do they have the same disease as your patient? But then also information about the function of all of the genes. Um, and really, the fact that this data is being uh, produced at ever-increasing rate means that we'll never be done, because there's always more data to incorporate.